TFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading up 542, NASDAQ up 158, S&P's up 53. That's a gain inside the Dow Industrials of 1.7%, 1.3 in the S&P's, and 1.3 in the NASDAQ. Gold. Gold contract up $9.50 trading at 2007 an ounce. We have silver up $0.58, cents, $23.47 an ounce. Late sweet crude down $2.89, $82.65 a barrel, notes and bonds. A 10-year note. Down five ticks, trading 106.08. The 30 year down three at 109.13 in King Dollar. King Dollar's giving it up out here. Down 453 ticks, 106. One, oh, here we go. 106, 106. I like it. Euro is at 106. <laughs> Euro is at 106. Yen's at 149. British pounds at 121 to 1 US dollar. We get over and take a look at the spy first. And the bottom line is that what you have out here. You get a rally going, you're right down to where we had the strength and you rejected lower price out here. And what the SPY did do, you know, which is really positive for it, it actually got under the low of Friday and then basically took off. So what you're gonna have here is that you're gonna have a lower low with light volume and then you take off. Now the divergence is in the queues because what you have in the queues is that you just have light volume on the way up. Now the difference is, is that the Qs were definitely stronger than the SPY, I mean, in a huge way. They never made it all the way down to their strength. Um, you know, we'll see where this shakes out with the Qs, but it would be a lot better if the Qs had a lot higher volume, which they do not. If we go and take a look at the note and bond market, they still want higher price, lower yield. Right now you get the 10 year down four ticks, but there's no selling in it. You know, you got 1.2 million contracts right now, only down three ticks. So you're going to get a rejection of lower price out here. You have light of volume. We'll see whether they can get a sign of strength out here in the next uh, few days. Gold, gold contract continues to want higher price. And, of course, we're into window dressing now, too, folks, okay? Uh, bottom line with gold, gold's on uh, 171,000 contracts. That continues to want to run up into this uh, 21 uh, 29 area right now you're at uh, 2008 and good old king dollar is performing and giving that market some breathing room so you had king dollar was was building some calls last week you know got to higher price now you know now you're getting a wide price spread right again you're coming lower the king dollar was trading at 106091 and i suspect we're going to be getting back to this 104 699 that's what we broke out of stay right there folks come right back